damn thing better not have standing on me. What's up, everybody? Punching Bag Strunk Media, Boxing Media Incorporated, resident boxing expert, Greg right here uh, with a quick video. Uh, let's just say, I hope it's quick because you know uh, how I am. I'll, I'll just keep on going. Anyway, uh, just get prepared. And some people are going to be crying tonight. <laughs> I, I know it already uh, because I'm going to talk about some, uh, a fighter. And I guess uh, a lot of people love this, this fighter. And, and, uh, and I, I, you know, I, I, I don't. Look, I, 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 don't, I don't see that special ball. But anyway, we're going to talk about, we're here to talk about Edgar Belanga today. Edgar Belanga, uh, wait, first off, let me uh, tell you guys, take your butt over there, hit the, hit the subscribe, subscribe uh, uh, button and, uh, and the right button too. Hit it all, man. Ba -ba 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 -ba. I, you know, because uh, everyone helps. Anyway, back to what I was saying about uh, Mr. Edgar Belanga. Uh, uh, everyone seems to be, uh, you know, there's some buzz around. I guess it's going to be fighting the uh, Benavides. Uh, uh, and uh, I just wanted to just get right, right out of the gate, just to tell you that uh, there's no way he's going to beat David Benavides. And anyone that thinks that, uh, I'm going to have to stop questioning your boxing IQ. I, I don't, I don't, there's no way. It's, you know, it's, about this, this kid, uh, 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 Edgar Belanga, uh, I know everybody's high on him, and, and, and I don't want to sound, I, I really don't want to, like, really destroy the kid, but that's really what I want to do, but uh, but I'm not going to do that, because that's not nice, and, 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 and but, but I can't, I'm not going to sit here and say, no, I don't see it, I, look, he, he's like a lot of these kids today, they're, they're decent, but these days, people call decent fighters great. And they call good fighters all-time greats. So the, the barometers are all screwed up there. It's all screwed up there. I mean, you know, everyone, you know, Canelo, great, all-time great. I mean, I, you know, it's like, just get this stuff back in perspective here. You know, this, this kid's a prospect. Uh, uh, he, you know, he's heavy-handed. I'll give him that. He, you know, I don't even think he's like a great one. <laughs> all right, let me start over. For to be a great knock a one punch knock off boom guy, it has to be some explosion. Uh, 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 not, not like a pop, 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 pop on your punch. That's a Tommy Hearns, perfect example. That right here, pop, it means to just, just decapitate people that right here, just pop on it. These are the guys that, uh, that make great one punch KO. <laughs> See you later, guy. Uh, knockouts. Edgar Langer is a heavy handed kid. Heavy hands is not. Explosion, okay. Heavy hand. Only one that gets away with heavy hand stuff is George Foreman because he's just so heavy-handed that he gets slow. But if it hits you, it knocks the building down. But Blank is not on that, that, that type of heavy-handed. Uh, he's he's a he's a good heavy-handed kid, but not a real explosive puncher. Uh, you know what I mean? So I don't care how many knockouts he got. Who, who the hell he fight anyway? But my point is this: uh, uh, he, he, he's a decent upcoming uh, prospect. That's it. Just not even a not even contender. I don't care what everyone else is saying. He's a prospect. Uh, you know what I mean? Uh, these, these kids, these kids get uh, 15, 20 fights, and people automatically put him in world class and and, and all this stuff. He's nothing more than a prospect. Uh, all right. Hey, uh, uh, I, hey, girl, I'm saying it. Uh, you know, I ain't gonna whoop my ass. Uh, <laughs> like I always say. Uh, but look, uh, let me slow back. Because for the, because I can hear them all uh, crying right now. Uh, I, I don't want to make nobody cry today. But the bottom line is, uh, it's probably breaks on this kid, Echo Belanga. You know, there's nothing really spec. Look, decent, uh, you know, decent, decent skill. I don't even, I think it's just way too slow. I'm just gonna say what it is, but what I what I gonna say? I think he's just too slow. You know what I mean? He, you know, he, he's quiet. He's not really that fast. I, it's nothing that I see that makes. What do I always tell you guys? It's nothing that makes me go wow. When I when when when, when you know when, when you see a great fighter, it's like you know it. Whoa! That's why, I, like, Tank. I, I you know I know the Tank haters and all that, but when I seen that kid Tank Davis, it was like. Whoa, I knew it. Seen an early Sugar Ray Leonard? Whoa, you know it. I'm going down the line. But now these days, kids get 20 fights and they're calling them world-class fighters. Sometimes they're calling them great fighters. 
you know, these kids are fighting for titles at 14, 15 fights. Back in the day, you had to have 30 fights to even get in the garden and get a fight. The old timers know that. Uh, but we're not gonna do that old school versus new school. Not going there today. I'm just here to stay focused, Fred. To stay focused. I'm just here to uh, tell you guys to pump the brakes on this kid at Gabalang. First of all, you're not gonna beat Dave and Benavides anyway. Dave and Dave Benavides ain't like uh, world leader, and he's decent too. Like de decent. You know what I mean? He, you know, he keeps head up a little bit too much. Uh, 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 smacks too much. I mean, there's all kinds of deficiencies. And he's in, 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 in the fight game, and in, in, in that guy's style, and then Belanger, just a just a basic strong kid that that and look doesn't even throw a straight right. Everything he throws is looping. Everything throws is looping. You know what I mean? Uh, you know, so you know, I, I'm just saying, pump the brakes on this kid. I'm again. I, sometimes you, you have potential to be better. Uh, you just keep working hard, and, and but sometimes you just you're at your your ceiling. You know what I mean? Let me let me let me let me put it this way, see I'm, I'm gonna break it down on a whole nother level. Okay? God-given talent. If you got God-given talent, that means you are better than the rest. Okay? That means you got special, something special. You're either faster, you run faster, you hit harder, you 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 write faster, you cook better, whatever your talent may be, that means you just got you just better than anyone else. Okay. When you got that God-given talent, you 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 can't help but to be good, okay? It, even if you don't, that's why your guys that uh, go and they say they kid they don't have to work hard. They don't have to work hard to do 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 things that people have to work extra hard to do. In other words, uh uh uh, they 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 can they'll still be all right. If you got a guy that's gonna be a great fighter, uh, and he's got God-given talent. He, if he works hard, he becomes an all-time great, okay? If he doesn't work hard, he can't be no less than good. Now, you got guys that don't have no talent, but they work hard. I don't want to throw their names out there, but I could, I could, I could do that, but I don't want to offend anybody. But guys that just ain't, ain't really good, but they just work so hard that they, they, they become good. But they can never be great because you need God-given talent to, to be great. You understand Ali? Good. Now if Ali doesn't work hard, then he's he's just good. He's never gonna be a journeyman or, or a club fighter, nothing like that. Because he's just got special. Special, fast, special, special. So what I'm trying to say is that a lot of these kids going up today, people are tagging them as great when they're just good. You understand what I'm saying? Just a good fighter. I don't know. Some ain't even good. I mean, but they, you know, he could not load a couple of tomato cans and everybody, ah, this guy, and they, they don't know about boxing. That's what I'm saying. Uh, you know what I'm saying? So, Eric Belanger falls in that good category. He, he's not world class yet. He, he, he's, I don't want to call him a journeyman. Uh, he's a prospect, a hot prospect. All right? Hot prospect. That's it. That's it. You know what I mean? That's it. Uh, pretty decent puncher. Too slow for my liking. He needs to have more speed. Uh, 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 water, you know, a good boxer, just pick up a pot, Jesus Christ, uh, just pick up a pot, because he, you know what I mean, and that's why I'm saying David ben David Benavides will beat him, and, and not because David Benavides is extra great, I know this guy so sounds like a completely hating video, and there's a bunch of people crying right now, uh, but I don't care, I don't care, I got my pain, and what I always tell you guys, I got my pain, I can say my pain, you don't like it, too bad, just, just, just too bad. Yeah, you yeah, know yeah, that sensitive stuff. Get out of here with that. You know what I mean? Bottom line is that's why I think David Benavides is gonna beat him is because he has he speeds he's fast. He, he, he smacks a little bit, but, but you know he smacks a little bit, but he he's fast and he, he's pretty good. I like him. I, I, I like him. But a lot of these kids that are coming up today, they they they're basic stuff. They heads too high. What what is all this stuff? This is why I love that kid, uh, Virgil Ortiz. Just throw back old school. Hands up, tucks his chin, and brings it, brings it. Let's go. Brings the fight. That's what I like. That all this stuff here. <laughs> I what I would tell you guys, all right? Fencing jump. <laughs> tap tap, point, point, point. Give me my money. That's I don't like that stuff. Uh, Virgin, bring, bring it. Uh, 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 David Benavides, uh, uh, you know, he, he's up here too much. You see this stuff? That 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 is not proper technique. Anytime you throw like this, not proper tech. I don't give a damn how many wins you got. I don't give a how many knockouts you got. This is not proper technique. Whoever's teaching that, he take your ass somewhere out of the gym. Uh, take your little Amazon book you bought and said you want to be a 
trainer, get I go somewhere because because that this is not proper technique. I'm tired of seeing these kids doing this stuff. And what it comes from is all that fencing, that hiding behind the shoulder. <laughs> That's why this is where you should be. Right here, let's bring it, let's play. And all this stuff here, <laughs> this was ruining boxing. Back in the day, if you had your left hand down, it was a you it across the board trainers. Pick your left hand up. But now look at this. Everyone's here. Everyone's here with this. And let me tell you something. Most you dudes can't do it. Now you see Floyd master it, but there's a lot of guys that master it. Guys like James Tony master it. Guys like uh, there's a lot of guys that master that hide behind your shoulder, pop shot, your style. But most you dudes don't have the peripheral vision for one. The peripheral, do you know what that is? That's seeing outside. That's seeing outside the box. Peripheral vision. Most you guys don't have the peripheral vision to see them shots. Uh, most of you guys don't have the reflexes to, to master that style, but, you, but you're trying to do it. Same thing like back in the day, when Ali used to pull back from punches and get away from get away from punches, because he had extraordinary reflexes and, 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 and awareness that he, when you come to the heat, he, he, this was a no-no back in the day, pulling back from punches. But what happened? When people see Ali getting successful with it, a lot of the kids coming out, I want to fight like Ali, and they start doing it. You know what happened? When they start pulling back, they get knocked the hell out. You know what I mean? So th that's why I tell you guys to uh, make your own style. What I, what I give you guys the analogy in my other video about the guitar player. There's been millions of guitar players, but they get up, you practice their songs, but you make it, you start incorporating your own stuff. Same thing with boxing. You know what I mean? Don't take no one else's stuff. Anyway, I, I, I cut the plea off track. Uh, 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 or Edgar, uh, but yeah, I, I'm just saying, uh, I, I'm quite sure, Edgar, you can uh, make some money. Me, your fighters make the money now. Sure, I could probably come out of retirement today and make some money. And you got Jake Paul doing it, and everyone else doing it. Uh, uh, but my point is, uh, Edgar, uh, you, you'll, you'll make some money, uh, and you, you might even get a belt. Uh, uh, you know what I mean? Work hard, just keep your nose to the grind, and all that, but. For all you Edgar uh, Belenga fans that are just, uh, uh, just, just retarded, like I, look at that, and we don't want to make this up. Uh, and don't, don't come on my timeline with that racist nonsense. I, I don't care what color you are. You good, you good. Uh, you know, I, I, you know, it is what it is. So don't be trying to make this a, a, a race thing, because I know a lot of you dumbasses uh, try to, try to say, oh, you don't like him because he's Puerto Rican or whatever, I don't even know what he is, but I'm just saying, I think it's Puerto Rican, but I'm saying a lot of you jackasses come on and say, oh, you don't like him because of that, you know, but you don't know me, because I, 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 I roast anybody, you know, I, I, I ain't no fit, you know, I'm not phony, you know what I mean, I, I, but I call like I see it, and I, and I tell the truth, and like I see it, and, you know, and I've been in boxing 40 something, 50 years, my whole life, so I, I, I know what I'm talking about, so anyway, this is not like an angry video, do <laughs> <laughs> Maybe a little angry. We're gonna argue my way today. No, I wasn't. No, hey, no, I wasn't. Shut your mouth. All right, anyway. Listen, guys. Uh, 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 I, I wish uh, you guys had uh, good luck. I, this is really directed. It ain't really directed at Edgar. Maybe I should just pump the brakes out a little bit. Not really directed at him. Uh, it's just that I'm sick of hearing all these uh, uh, casual fans that don't know a damn thing about boxing uh, uh, talking just nonsense. You know, like this guy's the second coming of uh, uh, Salvador Sanchez. Get out of here with that. You know what I mean? No, he's, he's, a, he's a solid prospect. Punch is pretty decent. Not crushing power, but decent power. Uh, too slow. Needs to work on some speed. Uh, basic mechanics is not really that great. Looping that right hand. Never throws it down the pipe. Smacks the hook a little bit too much. You know, it's, I, I think there's plenty there to pick on the stop. And, it, and this stuff comes with practice. You, gotta, you have to practice. You know, you, you have to practice. You know what I mean? The, 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 the mass of the stuff. This is all repetition. Bop, 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 bop. You know how many times you gotta do that? You become good at that? Hundreds of thousands of times. Right here, bop, 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 bop. You know how many times you gotta do that? Become a great right hand puncher? Hundreds of thousands of times. So it's all repetition. But see, what's happening is, these days, these kids, they don't wanna take the time. That's why you got so many converted softboards. And you know what that is? That's a guy that's right-handed that wants to set up in an orthodox stance. I'm sorry, this right-handed wants to set up in a southpaw stance. Basically, put the good, good fair hand in the front. You know why you put the good hand in the front? Because you're too damn lazy to work the, the hand that, that's not, that you're not good with, that you don't write with. So you so so you rather just do this. Now you got now you got a guy that has a great right hook, but he Look at this here, he, he's ineffective with that. And you know what I'll tell any of the fighters I'm training? Just move to your right. 
all night long. Cause he ain't gonna do nothing with that. So I just have my fucking circle on that one to the right all night long. He don't have to do nothing. He's gonna be looking for the hook all night. He's gonna be missing. You understand? This is the guy. Anyway. Anyway. My prediction. Uh, Dave Benavides beats uh, Errol Berlanga. Errol Berlanga uh, gets stopped in five rounds. Uh, and, uh, and if you think I'm hating on him, I, I don't care what the hell you think or say. Uh, uh, I call like I see it. I'm not kissing on his ass because they're undefeated. I'm not kissing on his ass because everyone loves him. And I'm not going to bite my tongue because I'm afraid of a bunch of uh, trolls uh, from the Edgar Berlanga army coming to try to talk to me. I'm not Blue Blood Sports, buddy. I, I'm not that. I, well, I should do him like that. But my point is, I'm not that other guy either. Boy, that dude, all these wannabe comic or boxing uh, analysts and commentary. I see so many on there. That boy, that dude, I was. I'll give him a shout out to Because, you know, don't know a damn thing about nothing. Just a bunch of nerds trying to be boxing guys now. You know what I mean? Yeah, this isn't any video. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, what's your best script up coming? You get the best time by. I'm ready for you guys. I'm ready for it. Bring it, bring it. I'm ready for it. And I'm talking about uh, your, your, your typing skills. Uh, uh, you know, and I'm not talking about going, you know, fighting. You know, hey, look, uh, don't get me wrong. Uh, uh, you, you don't want to know this anyway. But my point is, uh, uh, you know, let me know. Let me know. Let me know what you think. You know what I mean? Tell me what way I'm wrong. Tell me where Edgar Berlanga is a great fighter. Where he's fast. Cause I said he's not bad. I said he's slow. I said he's too damn slow. And to tell me where he's a great one punch banger like a Julian Jackson. Where, where, no, he's not a Julian Jackson. So he ain't no big crushing one or uh, uh, Joe McClellan or Julian Jackson. Or he's not one of them guys. He's just a heavy handed kid that got a little pop on his punches. Alright? What two, you know, maybe, maybe even these are. Get it in a little better shape. You know, I, I, I can go on. I, I, I ripped the kid apart. I'm not going to do that. I'm trying to be nice. You can, I'm trying to be nice. You know what I'm saying? But uh, anyway, slow, they pump your brakes on now, nigga. He, he pay your dues, man. Pay your dues. Y'all be on, on YouTube. This is run too. All these kids getting on YouTube and, 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 and making these videos, and, and these kids see it, and they're like, oh, you must be great. <laughs> You know, they don't know no better because it's dumbasses. So, you know, you know what I mean? Because that's the problem with social media. That they would have had that. They had that. that social media is, 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 is making kids think that fighters are world beaters when they're, they're, they're the egg beaters. And I'm not calling that. No, I didn't call them egg beaters, so don't. don't <laughs> let me say I didn't call them egg beaters. He, he, you know, he, he's decent. All I'm saying is he's decent. All these guys are decent. They're not great. You're not great. And that's my word. And I don't care who don't like him. He's not a great, he's not a great fighter. He's a decent fighter. He's a good fighter. But he ain't a great fighter. Alright? Peace. Alright. We got the true champ here, Gregory. You know, big Gregory. I'm yeah, just yeah. champ. Oh, you know what I'm right there. You know what I'm right there. Right there. Big, big Gregory, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah. what's up, everybody? Can't mess with him, man. That's my dog right there, you know that's All right, you know what I'm saying? Garris, whatever, it ain't Gregory, though. The real champ yeah. out here, you know what I'm saying? I'm, I'm J1, all right? Why is he watching 1983 telling you the real champ right here? It's my family right there, Hey, champ. this ain't no three-piece suit, neither. We, we, nah, we cordulated. Nah, yeah. We cordulated, you know what I'm saying? That's right. We cordulated, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, this is nice right here.